So far in 2007, it's been big play after big play for LSU. To throw for the end zone. Doucet has it at the 15. Louisiana State. Number 15, Matt Flynn, the quarterback, has led the way, but no play has been more famous than this they give one. It to David, and he heads for the corner. LSU. From Matt Flynn. Well, it sure explains. The flip I thought was fantastic. He's the king of the flip. Yeah, you know, I flipped it and I looked over and I saw it was a good flip. And uh, you know, I was just excited that we finally got to run it. It was a lot of fun. And it might be a college football play of the year here. How about yeah. you spur your scratch on his head was the best uh, yeah. look of all, I think. It was funny. That, that was funny. In his five year tenure as an LSU Tiger, it hasn't always been easy, especially after earning Peach Bowl MVP <laughs> honors in 2005 and then having to step back and back up future number one draft pick, Jamarcus Russell. You know, anytime you come to college, you want to play. And, you know, it was disappointing not to be able to play, but, you know, I really, you know, learned a lot about myself. I learned a lot of patience. You know, honestly, I wouldn't, I wouldn't trade this one year of leading this team for four years starting anywhere else. Right here, down on the field, in the huddle, that's where Matt Flynn is at his best. And, you know, it took him four years to finally get to the starting job for LSU, and he's taken those reins and done an outstanding job this year. His teammates say his coolness in the pocket, his patience, his knowledge of the game is what's helped them so many times this year in all those pressure cooker down-to-the-wire games. You know, he's the kind of dude you want leading your offense. You know, he's just, he's such a good leader. He never gets, you know, just, uh, he's never, he never looks like he has pressure on him. You know, we've had some crazy games, you know, a bunch of fourth down conversions, last minute plays, so it, it's been fun. You see yourself in that championship game because you, you, you've got mm -hmm. a pretty good path there. We, we realize that, you know, we're in control of our own destiny right now, and we realize that we have to play good, you know, what everyone says, kind of coaches talk, but it really is true. You, you realize that if you want to get somewhere that you got to take it one step at a time. You have to, you have to, you have to keep the process in mind. So what does uh, one of the top quarterbacks in the SEC think about his hometown of Tyler, Texas, tuning in each Saturday to check out the purple and gold? Does that make you feel pretty good knowing the uh, whole city's kind of looking after you? Two yeah, guys? I mean, I'm, uh, you know, I'm proud to say I'm from Tyler. And, uh, you know, I'm proud to show everyone that. And, uh, you know, it's, it's fun to, you know, have people tune into LSU. And so, you know, we're just trying to, you know, make our families proud, make our friends proud.